Hey guys, welcome back. On this video, we're going to add the missing viewport on Maya 2019. Let's do this. All right, so first things first, let's uh, open up Maya 2019. Now, let's say if you freshly installed the application, you got your model in, you're ready to render this bad boy out, and then you notice that uh, something's missing. You head on over to render, and you notice that you only have viewport 2.0 and Arnold but uh where's the legacy where's the default what's good all right I'm gonna show you guys how to add this all right so uh close it out completely make sure you have you have to have Maya closed out completely so hit the exit don't save just give it a second okay now you're gonna want to go to file explorer and go over to your documents. Now, when you're in documents, you're going to notice that you have a Maya file, a Maya folder. So double click on that. And then you're going to see 2019. Double click on that. And then once you're in this folder, you're going to see under type, you're going to see Maya environment file. And it's going to say Maya as for the name. So uh, what you can do is right click, highlight it, and right click. Go to open with and go to notepad. Once you do that, it's going to open up notepad. You're going to see nothing here, but I want you to go over to the video description. There's going to be uh, a line of text that you're going to have to copy and paste right here. So right click, go to paste. It's going to be Maya underscore enable underscore legacy underscore viewport equals one. Once you got that pasted in there, go to file, go to save. Close it out, double click it, make sure that it's in there. That way it's saved properly. Okay, so now uh, now we can close these out. Open up Maya 2019. There we go. All right, let me close this out. And let me toss in a model. That way we can get some uh, good representation here. So, whoops, just wanted to toss it in there, but okay. All right, so here we go. All right, so that's my model. Now, if I head on over to render, you notice that now instead of two options, I have four. So I have the viewport 2.0 that came with my 2019, but we have the missing legacy default viewport. And we also have legacy high quality viewport. And we also have Arnold. So you can choose between whichever one you feel more comfortable with. As you can see, I have my little cube back. So I can navigate my character a little bit more. And if I press six on the keyboard, it'll show me the textures. So there you have it, guys. That's how you add the missing viewport to Maya 2019. If you like the video, hit subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.